I would like to begin this video by congratulating Tata Motors on achieving a 5 star safety rating from the global end cap for the new Harrier and the Safari. This was long due. In today's video, we are going to discuss the variants and features of the 2024 Tata Harrier facelift which has been launched in India recently. I will explain all the features available in each and every variant of this vehicle and at the end of the video, I will tell you which is the most value for money variant and which variant you should actually put your money on. So before we get started, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe to the Motorbeam channel. The Tata Harrier is available with a 2-litre diesel engine making 170 PS of power, 350 Nm of torque, available with a 6-speed manual or a 6-speed automatic. There are 4 trim options available on sale, smart, pure, adventure and fearless. And of course, these 4 variants also have other sub variants like option pack plus a pack and plus s pack so what we'll do is we'll start off with the base variant of the harrier which is the tata harrier smart priced at rupees 15.49 lakh x showroom Talking about the features on the Harrier Smart, we have LED projector headlamps, LED DRLs, LED tail lamps, 6 airbags as standard, yes 7 are available only on the top end variant, this base model gets 6 airbags as standard, you get a tilt and telescopic adjustable steering wheel with an illuminated Tata Motors logo, fully automatic climate control system, 17 inch alloy wheels, ISO fix style seat mounts, electronic stability control, hill hood control, traction control, rollover mitigation, brake, disc wiping, a lot of features are available on the base range. You also get a panic brake alert feature. And apart from that, you get the usual rear parking sensors. This base variant also gets height adjustable seat belts for the driver and the co-driver. This is something which is missing on the Mahindra Scorpio N. And apart from that, you get a central locking system with the parametric alarm system and all four power windows, of course. Apart from this, the second row seats of the Harrier get a 60-40 split function and the second row seats also get AC vents. And that's about it. The interior color theme of the Harrier Smart is a little different compared to the other variants or other personas of the Harrier and you can have a look at the color scheme on the screen right now and now what we'll do is move on to the next variant which is the Tata Harrier Smart O variant which is priced at Rs 15.99 lakh X showroom which means it is 50,000 more than the Smart Base variant. What are the extra features on the Smart O variant compared to the Smart variant? You get connected LED DRLs at the front and the back. You get a front central armrest. You get electrically adjustable mirrors. You get roof rails. You get TPMS which is tire pressure monitoring system. And you get Type A and Type C USB ports in the second row of the Harrier. That's about it. The Tata Harrier Pure is priced at Rs 16.99 lakh X showroom which means it is priced 1 lakh rupees more than the Smart O variant of the vehicle and this is also offered with a 6 speed manual only. Automatic is not offered on the Smart, Smart O and the Pure variants. We will start off with the infotainment system because this variant gets a 10.25 inch Harman touchscreen infotainment system. The lower variants don't have an infotainment system at all. So, you have to fit the aftermarket. Apart from that, the Pure variant also gets a 10.25 inch display for the digital instrument cluster. And this variant gets 6 speakers, meaning 4 speakers and 2 tweeters. This variant also gets a rear view camera. You get 250 plus voice commands. And this variant also gets OTA updates and a rear shark fin antenna. One last thing on the Harry Pure is the 45 watt USB Type C fast charger. Coming to the next variant, we have the Tata Harrier Pure O variant which is priced Rs 50,000 more compared to the regular Pure variant which means this is priced at Rs 17.49 lakh X showroom. What are the extra features? First of all, we talk about the rear wiper washer assembly. Ki. This is not available on the standard Pure variant. Apart from that, you get a remote central locking feature and that's about it. We have another variant in the Pure lineup which is the Harrier Pure Plus variant which is priced at Rs 18.69 lakh for the manual variant and 19.99 lakh for the automatic variant. Yaha se automatic variant ki shuruwaat hoti hai. What are the extra features on the Pure Plus variant compared to the Pure O variant? First of all, this variant gets a smart key with a start stop button installed on the vehicle. You get a height adjustable driver seat, you get cruise control, you get terrain response modes, normal mode, wet mode, rough road mode and this variant also gets a leather wrapped steering wheel. This variant with the automatic transmission also gets steering mounted paddle shifters and on the automatic you also get a smart e shifter. One last thing on the Pure Plus variant is the multi drive mode feature which means you get eco mode normal mode and sport mode moving on to the next variant we have another sub variant in the pure lineup which is the harrier pure plus s is key cap price hai? is key price is 19.69 lakh x showroom for the manual variant and 21.09 lakh x showroom for the automatic variant and what are the features over the pure plus trim let's talk about that you get a voice assisted panoramic sunroof you get rain sensing wipers and you get automatic headlamps just three extra features 
Moving on to the next variant in the Harrier lineup is the Tata Harrier Adventure, which is priced at Rs 20.19 lakh X showroom for the manual variant. No automatic on this one right here. But uh, what are the extra features of the Pure Plus variant? First of all, you get different designed 17 inch diamond cut alloy wheels. This one also has a different persona theme for the interior and exterior color options. So the trim colors are different, the upholstery colors are different, the inlays on the dashboard have a different color. And uh, apart from that, you get multi mode lighting on the dashboard of the vehicle, basically ambient lighting. And you also get lumbar support for the driver seat. Uh, of course, the height adjustable feature is available from one variant lower, but it's not good lumbar support. Bhi mil jata hai. Apart from that, this variant also has a rear window sunshade feature. This has rear center armrest. You get a rear defogger and you get a one touch up down function for the driver side power window two more features on this variant are follow me home headlamps and a cooling function for the front central armrest Tata Harrier Adventure ke baad aata hai Tata Harrier Adventure Plus variant which is priced at rupees 21.69 lakh ek showroom for the manual trim and rupees 23.09 lakh ek showroom for the automatic trim you get voice assisted commands of the sunroof well that was available on the lower variant also but isme aapko sunroof ke aaspas mood lighting mil jati hai ambient lighting near the border of the sunroof which is available on this variant you also get 18 inch aero alloy wheels and apart from that you also get an electronic parking brake epb with an auto hold feature this variant also has a wireless charger front parking sensors air purifier with an aqi display you get all four disc brakes which i think is a very useful feature now we have one more sub variant in the adventure variant which is the adventure plus a variant so this is priced at rupees 22.69 lakh for the manual trim and rupees 24.09 lakh for the automatic trim so you get 11 features of adas with this variant and apart from that you get an advanced esp with a driver dose of alert so that's about it two useful features adas and esp with driver dose of function Adaptive cruise control was not available on the previous iterations of the Harrier and Safari, but now it is available, but again available only with the automatic variant and not with the manual. Now we'll move on to the topmost variant in the Harrier lineup, which is the Harrier Fearless Persona. And uh, this is priced at Rs 22.99 lakh for the manual trim and Rs 24.39 lakh for the automatic trim. This has the most amount of features and a lot more equipment compared to the previous variants which I spoke about. So we'll start off with the infotainment system. So the lower variants, the base variants don't have any infotainment system. The mid variants have 10.25 inch screen. Mil jati hai. And the topmost Fearless variant gets a 12.3 inch screen from Harman, which is the biggest in size shared with the Tata Nexon EV and uh, apart from that this gets dual zone climate control with voice assisted function. The Harrier PLS also gets sequential turn indicators at the front and the back. The driver seat is six way electrically adjustable. There is a memory function and there is a welcome feature also so that when you open the car, the seat will come back and then when you sit and start driving off the seat will come back to the preset position. Apart from that the core driver seat also has a four way electrically adjustable function and this one also gets front ventilated seats. Moving on to the rear seats, this variant of the Harrier gets winged headrest for the rear seat passengers but unfortunately the Harrier doesn't have a middle headrest in any of the variants or personas. Talking about the speakers, well the lower variants had 4 speakers, 2 tweeters, this one has 9 JBL speakers. You get different sound modes using JBL's user interface and this one of course has again a different color theme for the interior, for the center console, for the dashboard inlays and some inserts on the exterior body also. The terrain response mode selector on the Harrier Fearless gets a bejeweled uh, finish and it looks more premium. It has a display also and uh, apart from that you get an auto dimming IRVM, you get hill descent control, you get a rear fog lamp, you get advanced ESP with a driver dose of alert feature and uh, that's about it. Lot of features on the Harrier Fearless variant. Next we'll move on to the Tata Harrier Fearless Plus variant. Yes, I know the Harrier has way too many variants and people are going to get confused so what are the pricing and what are the features on the fearless plus variant if you take it manual lenge, then the price will be 24.49 lakh x showroom and the automatic is priced at 25.89 lakh x showroom so basically on all the variants the difference between manual and automatic is 1.3 lakh rupees this one gets seven airbags as standard which means you get a driver knee airbag also and this is a big plus point because this is why the car is a uh, 5 star ki safety rating mili hai. and apart from that you get ADAS features, you get a gesture controlled powered tailgate, 4 tarikas iska tailgate open hota hai, pairs aap gesture se bhi open ke sakte, remote se open hota hai, button se open hota hai and of course there's a button on the dashboard also to open the tailgate of the Harrier. 
this variant also gets 10 JBL speakers. So basically four speakers, one front central speaker, one rear subwoofer and four tweeters. Apart from that, you get Alexa voice commands and emergency call and breakdown assist feature. So these were the basic variants of the Tata Harrier. Ab ye sab mein aapko dark edition bhi mil jata hai, which was available right from launch. So of course you get the different regular personas, you get the dark edition personas, sab ki pricing aap dekh sakte screen pe abhi. Which is the most value for money variant? I'll say that if you actually want to splurge, you want a lot more features, you want to keep the car for a longer run, and you don't mind shelling out extra at the time of purchasing the car, get the topmost variant. Airdas up ko chahiye, ya nahi, wo ab dekh lijiye. Lekin I think the topmost variant actually makes sense if you're spending already spending so much on buying an SUV. Isma ab ko sabi latest features mil jate, which make the car feel very rich and premium. And of course, for the longer run, I think you won't get bored of the car if you have so many features and gadgets to play around with. If you have a very tight budget, mein badi SUV le le, then you can consider the base variant. But some essentials are missing on that variant. You have audio system and all the things you have to do Or maybe through some Tata dealership itself. If you want something which is value for money, you don't want to spend a lot of money, but you want something which offers the basic essential features, then you can consider the mid variant, which is the pure or the pure plus variant. You get the essential things. If you want something which is you know not too expensive but it's not a extra premium nest chahi, then you can consider one of the adventure variants so that's about it from my side Which variant aapko value for money laga bataye mujhe niche comment section mein. and soon we'll see a video similar video on the tata safari also